Uh, thank God for Bitcoin. Yeah, it, yes. it's it's all about uh, the moral uh, case for money. And it, it comes from a Christian perspective. Uh, I got to write this uh, during COVID as a result of a Bible study that we started doing on uh, on Zoom. Uh, so basically, um, I, I knew <clears throat> I, I had gone to this conference uh, that Russell Kung put together. He's the left tackle for the Carolina Panthers, and he also wrote the forward for our book. And his brother-in-law, George, uh, who's one of my co-authors, is a Christian. And we started talking about it and we decided, OK, you know what, let's uh, let's do a Bible study of just some verses in the Bible that talk about money. And oh, my goodness, there are so many verses in the Bible that talk about money. Uh, so we, we started doing that. And uh, as we finished, um, he expressed some interest in uh, <clears throat> learning more about the economic aspect of it. And I come from the Austrian school and I'm, uh, I, I've read a lot of stuff on it. Uh, and uh, we decided to open it up to some more people. And we had about uh, 10 different Bitcoiners that I've known through conferences and so on that I knew were Christian. And we got together, we studied two books, um, The Ethics of Money Production by Guido von Holzman and Honest Money by Gary North. And both of them um, like treat uh, the monetary system uh, from an ethical perspective. And, uh, and we ended up uh, you know, doing uh, studies of both books. And at the end, we we were dissatisfied because both of them were, uh, ended with, hey, we need to go back on the gold standard and we need to get a political action committee together and convince enough people so that we the dollar can now be, uh, can go back to being backed by gold. And, uh, you know, I mean, we're reading this and thinking, OK, this is completely unrealistic and it, it, this is never going to happen. But we have this thing called Bitcoin where each individual can opt out. Uh, we need to write a book to like lay that out. And that's that's how the book started. Uh, we wanted to make the moral case for Bitcoin. Uh, and we wanted to do it from a Christian perspective. So there's a lot of uh, verses in there. We, we definitely take the Christian worldview in this book. And the hope is to give that uh, moral perspective, because for a lot of Christians, I think what they think of when they think of Bitcoin is, OK, it's, uh, you know, like the money used by drug dealers and uh, and traders that just gamble their money or something like that. Um, and for us, it's it's very much not that. It, it, it's a more moral money. And that's the argument that we wanted to make in the book. And that's that's what it covers. Mm -hmm.